We are the rock stars. Yes, we are. We like to sparkle, sparkle like a shining star. This virus thing will not get us down. We'll sprinkle our glitter all over this town. Singing, we will, we will rock you. We will, we will rock you. We are the rock stars, so they say. We like to run and jump and play. But now it's time to say goodbye. We're spreading our wings so we can fly. Singing, we will, we will rock you. We will, we will rock you. Oh my goodness, purple people. How awesome is that song? I love when Julie writes songs. And I personally, anytime I'm going to be a rock star, I got to wear some cool shades. And we're playing a lot of dress up around the Schoon Young household these days. How are you? How wonderful is this? It is Monday. We're here. This is going to be a fabulous week of fun. Um, how are you all doing? I am loving, loving, loving our Zoom calls and seeing you. The other day, my husband said, oh, that was the cutest thing, listening to all of your kids tell stories. Oh, I miss you all. Whew. Okay. Let's greet our fabulous fabulous morning today. Let's go. Good morning. Good morning. It's a good, 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 good morning. Say hello and how do you do to all your friends and your parents and your pets and your siblings too. Good morning. Good morning. It's a good, good, great, great morning. I think we just get right down to business on this one. So, last time that you were together with Julie at Julie's house, as a scarecrow, awesome. um, it was Friday, May 15th, 2020. And then after Friday, it was Saturday, May 16th, 2020. And then after Saturday, we come all the way back to the beginning again, and it is Sunday. May 17th, 2020. So, hmm, if yesterday was Sunday, today is Sunday, <gasps> it's Monday. And if yesterday was 17, let's just count from the beginning. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, it's 18, it is May 18th today. Right on. Um, and this is just a crazy, crazy pattern. So it goes blue, green, blue, green, fuchsia, yellow, fuchsia, yellow, blue, green, blue, green, fuchsia, yellow, fuchsia, yellow, blue. Oh my gosh, you guys are right. It is green, it is 18, and so we say, bam! Check that out. Whew, I hope you guys had some fabulous, fabulous weekends and you are able to play outside. I know my favorite thing lately has been drawing with chalk on our sidewalk and going for bike rides. And I look for people on our bike rides just in case because Evanston's not that big. Um, so let's see who's here today. Okay. There is a friend who I know and Jonathan is his name. Oh, J-O-N-A-T-H-A-N, 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 and Jonathan is his name, oh. There is a friend who I know, and Emmett is his name, oh. E-M-M-E-T-T, 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 and Emmett is his name, oh. There is a friend who I know, and... Charlie is his name, oh. C-H-A-R-L-I-E, 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 and Charlie is his name, oh. There is a friend who I know, and Aurelia is her name, oh. O-R-E-L-I-A, 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 and Aurelia is her name, oh. There is a friend who I know, and Cece is her name, oh. C E C I C E C I C E C I and C C is her name. Oh, 
there is a friend who I know, and Caroline is her name-o. C-A-R-O-L-I-N-E, 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 and Caroline is her name-o. There is a friend who I know, and Tilly is her name-o. T-I-L-L-Y, 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 and Tilly is her name-o. There is a friend who I know, and Ruby is her name-o. R-U-B-Y, 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 and Ruby is her name-o. There is a friend who I know, and Zoe is her name-o. Z-O-E, 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 and Zoe is her name-o. There is a friend who I know, and Tommy is his name-o. T O M M Y T O M M Y T O M M Y and Tommy is his name O. There is a friend who I know and Harrison is his name O. H A R R I S O N H A R R I S O N H A R R I S O N and Harrison is his name O. There is a friend who I know and Aiden is his name O. A I D E N A I D E N A I D E N and Aiden is his name o. There is a friend who I know, and Jonah is his name o. J O N A H J O N A H J O N A H and Jonah is his name o. There is a friend who I know, and oh, Eleanor is her name o. E L E A N O R E E L A N O R E E L E A N O R E. Whew, that's a tongue twister. And Eleanor is her name O. There is a friend who I know, and August is his name O. A U G U E S T. A U G U S T. A U G U S T. And August is his name O. There is a friend who I know, and Noah is her name O. N O A. N O A N O A N Noah is her name O. There is a friend who I know, and I is his name O. A U G I E A U G I E A U G I E and Augie is his name O. There is a friend who I know, and Emerson is her name O. E M E R S O N E M E R S O N E M E R S O N and Emerson is her name O. There is a friend who I know and Remy is her name O. R E M I R E M I R E M I and Remy is her name O. Oh my goodness, we're here! We are here again in my basement. Today we're going to talk about tadpoles. Tadpoles are little baby, baby, baby frogs. They're frogs when they're babies. They're tadpoles. Um, and we're going to read a book about tadpoles and then maybe make some tadpoles. Um, it is going to be awesome. And the book is called 999 Tadpoles. And, you know, when I was a kid, sometimes we could catch tadpoles in little ponds and areas around our house. And little puddles and ponds everywhere. We could get tadpoles. They're kind of gooey and slimy because they like to swim. So... One warm spring day, 999 tadpoles were born. Although they were very tiny, they were full of energy. Mother and father frog were very, very proud. The 999 tadpoles grew and grew and grew until one day they grew into frogs. Now the pond was too small for them. We can't move, one called. We can't breathe, called another. Don't push, called a third. We have a situation here, said father. We'll have to move, said mother. So 999 young frogs scrambled to get out of the pond. Shh, said mother. The world is a dangerous place. You must be very, very careful. Follow your father, cried mother. So 999 young frogs followed their father across the field. But no matter how far they went, all they saw was more grass. When will we get there, asked one. I'm hungry, said another. 
I'm tired, said a third. Keep hopping, said father, or a scary snake might get you. What's a snake? asked the frog children. A snake can eat a whole frog in just one swallow, said father. It's a very, it has a very big mouth and a very long body. Like this? asked the children. Oh, look what they're holding. Yes, said father. The snake was sleeping peacefully. It must have just eaten. Run for your lives, said mother, before the snake wakes up. So 999 young frogs ran for their lives across the field. They didn't notice a hungry hawk flying over their heads. Then the hawk swooped down. and grab father. Oh, let me go, cried father. Not a chance, said the hawk, and rose into the sky. Uh-oh, what's gonna happen? Let him go, cried mother, and she grabbed onto father's leg. Let them go, cried 999 young frogs, and they grabbed on too. Whoa, that's a lot of frogs. Why is this frog getting so heavy, said the hawk. And he looked back. Wow, he was carrying a whole year's supply of frogs. He was so pleased, he flew even higher. Check out all of those frogs that he's holding in his talon. Whoa, that's a lot of frogs. The 99 young frogs loved it. This is great, said one. What of you, said another. Whee, said a third. Mother and father were not as enthusiastic. They were worried about falling. Don't let go, warned mother. No matter what, added father. They were really, really high up. And do you see the clouds? They were all the way up to the clouds. The hawk flew on and on. So 999 young frogs were getting restless. I'm hungry, said one. When will we get there, asked another. I'm tired, said a third. The 999 young frogs began to wiggle. And every time one wiggled, the hawk swerved. Hang in there, hawk, said father. Don't let us go. That is a lot of frogs. But the hawk couldn't hold on any longer. Ah, cried father. Mother and father and 999 young frogs fell down from the sky. Splash, splash, Mother and father and 999 young frogs fell into a pond. A big pond. It's cool, said one. It's wet, said another. It's home, said a third. Aw. Oh. And that's how mother and father and their 999 young frogs found a new home. For all I know, they're still there singing, Ribbit, Ribbit, Ribbit. Oh, I like the smiling rainbow too. I think that's really, really, really fun. So today, what you are going to need, if you have it, is, this is actually an egg carton but it's only for holding one egg. I broke up the egg carton. Um, now, if you didn't have this, could you use a part of a paper towel tube? Totally could. You just need it to be small because this is gonna turn into a cute little tadpole, a baby, baby frog. So, now once you have this, you could sit there and say, hmm, I'm gonna paint it and you could totally paint it. If your parents are gonna let you paint this, go for it. You could probably take like green paper like this and cut it up and glue it all over that. That would be a good way to turn it green. Basically, you need to turn this to green. So what I did is I have some art pens and I colored one green, but I colored it light green and now I'm gonna take my dark green marker and I might make some spots all over it because these tadpoles are cute and spotted, right? 
Actually, I don't know if tadpoles are really spotted, but I just thought the green would be fun in here. So we have little green spots all over our green tadpole. How cute is that? Well, tadpoles have little tails. Can you even imagine that a frog starts out by having a tail? It doesn't have legs, it just has a tail. So I have some green paper, and I'm just gonna cut a squiggly, squiggly line. You can make it as big as you want it, as short as you want it. Mine kind of looks like this. Take a little tail, maybe from a tadpole. And what I am gonna do is I'm gonna take some, where did I put my tape? I'll take some glue. I'm gonna glue my tail onto my egg carton. And if you don't have glue, you could use tape. You could use a glue stick if you had a glue stick. I had some good old Elmer's glue. Now I've been told that I can't use the clear glitter glue anymore, just in case I'm a nice mom sometime and I let my kids make slime. We're saving that for summer. <laughs> so now my tadpole looks like this. Now the last thing my tadpole needs my tadpole needs some eyes because we want to look at this cute little tadpole. And because, you know, I kind of think the sparkles make everything better, I've got some sparkles to put as my eyeballs today. Um, but if you don't have sparkles, could you use a Sharpie and just make a black dot? Totally. Could you put a piece of paper there? Totally. Could you use a button? Also totally. Whatever you have at your house or whatever your parents say you can use, that is what you can use for this art project. Um, and if you want, because usually when you get eggs, you get 12 in a packet, it's called a dozen. This is my tadpole. It's got sparkly little red eyes and a tail. Now, I actually had 12 of these little things, so I can make a whole tadpole family. Or maybe if your brother or sister are home with you and they're like, wow, I want to make a tadpole too. Then you can let them make a tadpole and you can teach them how to make a tadpole. So make as many tadpoles as you would like. It's going to be awesome. You can make a whole, whole family. All right. I think that we need to sing We Will Rock You one more time because we are the Purple Room rock stars. So I have to get my glasses back on. Gotta look like a rock star. Okay, are you ready? Okay, go. We are the rock stars, yes we are. We like to sparkle like a shining spar. And I just said spar, let's start over. Okay, we are the rock stars, yes we are. We like to sparkle like a shining star. This virus thing will not get us down. We'll sprinkle our glitter all over our town singing we will, we will rock you. We will, we will rock you. We are the rock stars, so they say. We like to run and jump and play. But now it's time to say goodbye. We're spreading our wings so we can fly. Singing, we will, we will rock you. Singing, we will, we will rock you. All right. I love you all. I will see you tomorrow. Have a good Monday. I miss you. Bye.